Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and today we are reacting to Capito Balestro... Balestros... Balesteros... Capito Balesteros and Natalia no, 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 Cagno. No, 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 no. Capito Balesteros collab with Nathaniel Cagno. I got this through, but the song is called Lulu. Let's get into this. So, comments. what happened to your poquito espanol? My poquito espanol is tired. Got okay, it's tired. But let's go, Gabby. Man, no subtitles. Ah, Y'all killing us. Shot by Piri Pablo. So, Piri Pablo Stop producer? Now? Go Who right said that? that? It may not be the same Pity Pablo we thinking. Shot by Pity Pablo. How many Pity Pablos do you know? I mean, there may be many Pity Pablos. I guess, but the is Pity it Pablo. The Pity Pablo. Yeah, the Pity Pablo we know is um, mm -hmm. good for him. He's a producer now, cause yeah, he don't make no music, not that I know of. Yo, it's giving the. Lady Gaga. Peso Pluma vibe. Peso Pluma. Lady mm. Gaga. Huh. Because the other song we did, Peso Pluma with Natalia and Cano, it might not be posted up yet because of copyright, but we'll eventually get it posted if this comes and drops before that. But we did do the Peso Pluma, Natalia and Cano, PRC, I believe. Nathaniel. Nathaniel. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, it's definitely giving a peso pluma, pluma yeah, very definitely. similar, yeah. At least for us that are not too familiar with this type of music, so it's very similar. Ah, Isn't that peso pluma? Or is that Nathaniel? Then we got them mixed we up in the other video. We got them mixed up in the other video. Huh. Huh. Okay. We're learning. We, we in this ride together. Nope. I wonder if they film partial of this while they're doing the tour because he's on stage and he's having a good time. So like it's cool like some of the scenes from like his tours they're making to the videos. Yeah, we were wrong. Peso Plum was the other guy. The other guy? Yeah. Ah, so so we see? had it mixed up so in the other see? video. Yeah. So yeah, the other video we thought Peso Plum was Nathaniel Cano and Nathaniel. Ah, was, okay. Yeah, but okay, it is what it is. We're learning. By the way. Gabito's birthday is July 23rd. <gasps> He's a Leo. Let us know what the song is about because mm -hmm. we have no subtitles and all we see is ass so... I mean, the song for us, it looks like it's about the ass shaking. It's about so, Lulu, so yeah, I want to so know. Let, let us know what the I song is about. I think it's about a girl named Lulu, and they're focused on her. You think so? I think so. To me, I think it's about partying. So, partying? Yeah. Lulu? Oh, maybe Lulu is a short for like a, some word for party. I don't know. But these guys are definitely here for the vibes. I'm going to be at this party. I yes, really yes. like this this style of music, like yeah. it was the Peso Plumas songs. Yeah. This it's really something about yeah, it. It makes it. you it want, makes to, you want to dance. dance yeah. With somebody. Yeah. Oh, it's low, low. It's not Lulu. Low, low. Yeah, it's pronounced low, low. Didn't they say low, low was like a drug? Oh, who, I don't know. Uh, it could be. Because mm -hmm. I know Lady Gaga, they said it was like a champagne or something. Mm -hmm. So, it could be. They say Lady Gaga. 
Oh, they said Did you hear? You hear it? No, I didn't catch it. Okay, Moe. You know, I'm not gonna lie. If I was in a concert, I want my artist to face me because those tickets, I know it costs some money. What do you mean, face you? Like, you see, they're kind of like filming. Oh, they're in the circle yeah. and there's. Like you're saying, the seats are all around them? No, 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 but that's another controversy. I'm oh. saying that, you know, the, it looks like there's a stage, they're on a stage, but they're also trying to shoot this music video too as well. So, oh, I'm wondering. Like this? If, yeah, there, yeah. Oh, but and, that's probably just a short frame. Like, I think. I don't could... know, this was all throughout the whole song. We get scenes nah, from the concert. I think it's just a short so frame. So, I wonder. I'll be like, hey, I'm over nah, here. It's, it's gotta be a, just I paid a, short a ticket. Frame. You're, you're overthinking. Uh-uh. Mm -hmm. I know that money to co to sit in the front right there costs a good it does. bag. Yeah. Like I'm rent sure, money. I'm, I'm sure it does. I do want to say this is like our third reaction to like um mexican style music mm -hmm. it's different from like puerto rican spanish music. oh definitely and like yeah even, even it's colombian on its, own, it's, on its, it's, on its, it's own. very different yeah, it's, it's, on it's, it's very interesting it's, that it's a very different it, it's, it's very based on that instrument whatever, yeah whatever yeah that whatever is, is the country yeah. is like i feel like is there's national instrument they play off of that because even in the caribbean Jamaican music sounds different from Haitian music that sounds different from mm -hmm. Cuban music that sounds different from Bajan music that sounds different from like all these other type of yeah because like, Puerto Rico Puerto, Puerto Rican is like you reggaeton can, yeah, you it's like basically it, you cannot put it all in one category because they speak the same language you yeah. have to say they all have their individual styles that's unique to their countries and what's their yeah, cause, instruments cause, what's their sound their culture it's a whole way because right now we have just like a Latin music playlist but we, but we might oh, have to split be, it because it's gonna be it's very, very diverse. It's, it's very different music. Yes. Like you, you can't even put them in the same category just because they're it's Spanish. It's different. It's different. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. Because the Puerto Rico it's is different. reggaeton. Uh, Colombian is uh, what? Uh, so do you and news? I don't think you should list it off. Like you know. no, I'm just trying to like recall what we did. J Balvin yeah. is like more yeah, like we I don't did, know, pop. We did Colombian. We did Mexican. Yeah, we, and Puerto Rican. That, that's about uh, Anita Rican, too. But Anita, yeah, um, I don't know where, where to put Anita. I don't know. She's Brazilian, but she's like a pop. You yeah. so. But anyway, let's let's finish this off. But yeah, so far the the three non-rap Mexican reactions that we listened to. Mm are three for three in terms of the beat mm -hmm. like yeah. all of them the beat is Definitely. fire and i feel like it makes sense because those countries they're known to get you to like, the, the, like they're the known beat? from party dancing yeah for, like for the first day first the, thing first. the lady gaga the prc yeah. and the yeah. Lu, Lu, what is it lolo lolo yeah. yeah lolo the beats are fire yeah like they're really, really good like they really the beats yeah. are really, that, that's all we can judge about this because we don't speak the language mm -hmm. and there's no sub, so we can really just judge the beat and the music video so mm -hmm. Based our, my judgment on the beat is, is fire. Mm -hmm. yeah, I liked it. I, I liked it. I really want to know what they were singing about. Those yeah, let it, let us know comments. like what the just general gist of what mm -hmm. the song is about. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So let us know that in the comments down below. If you made it this far, please a like, comment, a flame emoji, and also subscribe. Join the fam. Help us out. Uh, we want to react to more of this kind of music from this artist, Capito Balesteros. Oh, you can pronounce it? Caño. I am just listening to Spanish <laughs> now. I'm very familiar, very ready to speak Spanish. Okay. And that was our reaction to Lolo. So, guys, as always, share as much kindness as possible. And I can't wait to talk to you guys in the comments. Bye, guys.